My wife. No, I'm not going to say it. My wife. Yeah, you just gave me head on the channel. Wow. Hey, welcome back to our stupid directions of Corbin. I'm Fred Astaire. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thanks to Patreon for the should account, subscribe and the like button. And welcome back to episode thrice of Farsa. Chutia Benchot Dada Beto. I don't know. I was just thinking of all the Indian words I know. Yeah. Uh, Dill is, in, see there. Dil is in there somewhere of, as well. Yeah. Um, Dill. Anyways, so, oh, spilling everywhere. Today, uh, you, I already said that. If you're just watching this on YouTube, <laughs> this is going to be a very cut up uh, This episode. is the circumcised version. Yes, you can see a very cut up footage. We can use about five minutes in each yeah. episode. Uh, so if you'd like to see the full uncut version of each episode, all eight of them, you can head over to Pop, Pop, Pop. Patreon. The uncircumcised version of OSR. Everybody on Patreon is uncircumcised. It yep, is known. It's true. It's actually one yep. of the requirements to In be fact, one of the patrons. If you're tired of being circumcised and want to be uncircumcised, go to Patreon. We will uncircumcise. We'll uncircumcise you there. Uh, anyways. Uh, we are the opposite of a bris. <laughs> a what? A bris. A bris? Yeah, that's the ceremony where the rabbi comes and snips the boy. Uh, I watched them do that to my grandson and thought, what on God's earth are we doing? Uh... This episode is called CC Fart. I'm not kidding. <laughs> I don't know if that's straight up. That is the says, title of the episode. The letter C, the letter C, and then the word fart. I'm wondering if that means email CC and the word fart. Right. Yeah, CC fart or I don't I have no idea. It is that's not a Hindi word, I'm guessing. Yeah. <laughs> it yeah, literally just C C the letter C, the letter C and the word One word. fart. C C F A R T. Yes, you know. Yeah. C C fart. A girl named CC farts in this. Well, there was a music called CNC Music Factory. CC fart. Yeah, it's a girl named CC. Anyways, farting. Let's, let's figure or out. It's a carbon copy fart, which has been known to happen amongst couples. Here we go. Or it's a farsi fart. Counterfeiting is a faceless crime. Isi le koi isse seriously nahi leta. Printing in our country is a big process. In our country, there is a lot of fake notes. Whether it is Bangladesh, Bangladesh, Burma, Nepal, or Afkos. Counterfeiting and Currency Fraud Analysis and Research Team, CCFART. What? This is CCFART. Who is this? This is Ministry's fart. Fart. CCCC fart. CCC fart. CCCC fart. C C fart, C C C C fart, fart, C C C fart, 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 he has, a, he has a voice. Did he just say, I want 20 crore? <laughs> Why is he always... Why is he... He's always the one doing the drinking. Small town people finding out they're good at something. Yeah. Taking it a little too far. Getting in over their head. We'll see if he has the alter ego, the... Heisenberg. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Like everything he does, I believe a hundred percent he is this guy. Mm. Oh my god. Here it is. The no. train wreck that is happy birthday. I've never seen people sing happy birthday worse than I have in Indian film. It's true. It actually happen at real birthdays. Like everybody just sings at their own pace. Thank you so much. Thank and in their own keys. Because that's every everyone. Jutia Baba. Thank you. Firstly, out of the blue, you call Secondly, clearly you're not invited. Thirdly, who gives a seven year old a phone? Okay. 
Because of the cast is mm -hmm. younger. Why is that door there? <laughs> you remember? I remember you. Personally. Yeah. Are किसी को भी भेज के? CT 600 sir. Yeah. Yes. So about that, uh, I have a request, sir. This is my resume. अगर वो चाय हो तो मना बिल्कुल मना नहीं मैं बस एंटरप्रेनर. Fifty percent. Good. Sir, is Okay, I'm welcome. This guy in Chaya, I swear. This note was in a restaurant, sir. It's not clear, sir. Mansoor Dalal. He's got to punch his neck. We have to stop close and close of rupees coming to India. He doesn't have to change anything. He's going to be a big deal. It's only a matter of time. Sir, like we have to... Mega. Sir. Uh, What's she doing? She's gonna stamp her paper. A good restaurant. A good restaurant? So, Starbucks chai chai. That was me every day in India. Yep. <laughs> no joke. Yeah, Mr. Artist. Art! <laughs> she has a quality about her that reminds me a little bit of Topsy Panu. Uh. <laughs> hey, 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 नहीं नहीं ये तो माधव साहब का है मैं यहाँ काम करता हूँ आप ये खोल सकते हैं हाँ जरा खोलो नहीं नहीं मैं बिना परमिशन के नहीं खोल सकता जल्दी कर फिर उस टाइम नहीं है ये साले अंदर आके रहेंगे समझा ना ओह यू गोना ब्रेक पैड I heard you were hiding some process. ACP ka phone aaya tha. He's going mad. ACP. Yes, yes. Sir, sir, I'm not raiding any more, sir. I'm just here in the area. Under map. Yeah, yeah, that'd be good. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. Sunny. Not very good. <laughs> So he's lying or does he have like I, amnesia? I think he's just having a little moment. I think he's having a moment. He's breaking bad. You're goddamn right. Those look like my old algebra books. It's KK. It's grandpa and he's in his right mind. Mm. Nice. Still no KK. Yeah. So they like they've 
I'm sure, obviously, they're just because he's the big time player. Yeah, and so that's they're more focused on the Shahid's character right now, and they'll get there. And it's like you don't meet um, exactly. You don't get to the chicken uh, restaurant. Gus. Yeah, you don't get to the chicken restaurant Without, to your way in. I, I, I'm not gonna give anything about Breaking Bad, but if you haven't seen it by now. What the fuck are you waiting for? That dude for weirdos. Just go watch, watch it. The best written show in the yeah. history of TV. It's the most consistently great show, I think, of all time. Yeah. Do it like it didn't have a bad season. Um only has one weird episode. Yeah. Only. Um but it's uh you, you kind of you wait a little while for that. And then also I don't know if he broke up with the girl. It seemed like that look he was like upset with her there at the end. Yeah, I think, I think he's it was done. last episode, right? Yeah, I think he's done. Uh, but I didn't see them break up or anything. He, I, I, I don't he's know. He's like my least favorite character, <laughs> and I don't know if it's the actress or if it's just the the way she's written, right? That it just irks me. Yeah, I just I'm... don't like her at all. <laughs> and I just she wasn't in this. But yeah, I don't know. Obviously, what they're going to do now in terms of yeah, I'm what are they going to do? I think I think Grandpa might die. Soon. Yeah, I, I think it might. Which that might, might happen. Access or, or they go to KK, KK or KK comes to them, or maybe they go and they help. He, maybe he becomes DJ. almost the. Yeah, it just doesn't seem like that's happening. No, yet. because going no something something bigger needs to happen in order for something like yeah. he needs to be in trouble with KK or something, and uh, for something like that to happen, I feel like right. Yeah, well. They've left me wanting to know, so that's really good. Because the question does, the big question is, what do they do now? I'd, yeah, I'd imagine, because he's not in good health right now. Anyway, he doesn't seem, but they just no, got. No, he's on the decline, and what they could do. But they just got a shit ton of money as well. They did. They could buy stuff, depending on how much that they've and kept. They could end Maybe it. their buddy there, the uncle. Let's them come in at night behind Grandpa's back. Still, who I don't know. Breaking Bad was such a good series. It's an incredible show. Just everything about that show. It's just Game of Thrones might uh, be overall my favorite show ever, um, but its last season majorly disappointed me, um, and so I can't call it the most consistently great show. Like I can't Breaking Bad. No, I, I. I wasn't bothered as much as you mm -hmm. with the last season, but and the rest of humanity. It when you get through Breaking Bad, it's the best. It's the best written show from episode one to the final episode. And anytime you have the greats, right, of shows. I mean, The Sopranos is pretty dang good too. Anytime you have a show that's sim similar in, like, even though it's not about drugs, it's about two people that come up. And kind of get into the world of crime, crime. in some way, you're going to be compared. Just like if you're a gangster film, you're going to be compared, you're compared to, to the Godfather. Godfather. It's just it's going to happen. Yeah. And if you're in a if you're in a series now that has to do with some type of people coming up in the in any kind yeah. of criminal world, where you came from the good world and you're going to go to the bad world, and you're really good at one thing, yep. So you start doing that thing in the criminal world, yep. You're going to be compared to Breaking Bad always. It's even though the, obviously the show no, is this really, very original. It's not really like it. Yeah. It's just they. Once again, I the think idea. I, I think writers have a hard time nowadays because every story has been told. You just you have to Pretty come much. up with creative ways in doing it. Except everything, everywhere, all at once. <laughs> that story had never been told. That's one of the things that makes it so great. But what's the overall theme of that story, though? Well, it, all, all stories go back to either Greek mythology hmm. or the ancient texts. Ancient. Ancient, ancient, ancient texts of, you know, like we've learned from all of the great stories that come out of the, Bra you know, the uh, Brahmastra kind of yeah, stories. Yeah, Hinduism. And, yeah, and, and all of all like of those stories of the great epic hero stories. Yeah, yeah, uh, it's good it's overcoming all, evil. I think all the uh, the cast is is doing a really good job. Yeah, uh, not a surprise. The uh, cast is no, great. not at all. V J is obviously a, a very believable. Uh, and I like I I I like I forgot her character name, the counterfeit girl who wanted yeah. to work with him. Uh -huh. I really like her. Uh, Shade's doing a great job. I'm, yeah. I'm missing. So is his buddy. I'm missing KK. Yeah, just <laughs> that's my actor, man. I love that guy. He's he'll be he, back. He's one of the. It's just when you 
and the, it's it's strange in like a series like this when you have great actors like Shahid and and VJ, but maybe it's just the fact that his role is the meaty role of the villain per se, the the antagonist of the story. That's the characters I always draw to. <laughs> is I want the I like the villains. Um, like everybody else always wants to be the the hero. That I was like, nope. Put a gun in my hand, Nawaz. <laughs> I will yep. be your villain. <laughs> I find them <coughs> so much more interesting than I find regular people. They have a much clearer objective than everybody else. Yeah, and also they're just not like cookie cutter. That's why I hate Captain America. Oh. And Superman. I hate them. They're my two favorites of all time. My Superman least... is my favorite of all time. They're my least favorite. And my favorite Avenger is Cap. Because they're so basic. What's the, basic about them? They, they have one through line. There's no... They have a very clear objective, that's just not like the bad guys. normal. <laughs> sure it is. And I get it. They're superheroes, but I want my... Batman, obviously. One of the most complex. Yeah. Uh, but he's technically not a superhero. He's just really rich. He, yeah, that's why he doesn't... He's not really a superhero. No, he's just a billionaire with gadgets. I like, not like Shakti Ma is a real superhero. We all know. Yeah. Shakti Ma. Um, or... Um, Flash or stuff like that. Yeah, but that's not what this is about. Uh, the billion. If you're gonna give me a billionaire superhero, give me Iron Man every day of the week over Batman. Tony Stark's far better than Bruce Wayne. I'll take them both. Yeah, I take Tony Stark over Bruce Wayne. Well, I'm not every day of the week. Oh yeah, in terms of personality, but in terms of um, well, even motive and objective and gadgets. I mean, the motives. Not too dissimilar from each other. No, they're very, they're very, very s- kind of similar guys. Yeah, but yeah. But I mean, Iron Man would definitely beat Batman. I mean, I don't know to the comics. I'm not that kind of person because I'm, I'm sure they fought in in the past, maybe. Probably. But yeah. Tony Stark just shooting a laser at Batman. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> just, <laughs> bye, Batman. <laughs> <laughs> just, just kill him dead right there. Anyways, back to the back to the series here. Uh, I'm, I'm really enjoying the setup uh, of it all. Um, three episodes in, this is very common. I feel like, especially with Raj and DK, Family Man. It's it was very subdued a lot of times, and then it just it, yeah. it steadily builds, steadily builds. It so it builds you, which is smart. It doesn't just punch you with action. It it. it Makes you care for these characters. Yeah, it makes you care for the people. And then gives you the goods in the end. Yep. I don't know if that's how this will end. I have no clue. Um, Because that one was with Fenway. It's a lot more cop centric. Yeah. So you have a lot more opportunities to have like shootouts or interesting things happen like that. Yeah. And I I like Shahid's character being a character who is um, got dual motives here. Maybe if not two, he's got at least three motives going on. He does have the motive to take care of and save his grandpa's business, mm-hmm. but he also has the motive underneath it all of giving it to the man. Yeah, and I'm tired of being the one that stepped on, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know, and uh, it, it's it's very much Heisenberg. Yep, yep. Uh, he is the one who knocks. Yeah. Um, anyways, uh, let us know what you thought about this episode, and once again, if you'd like to see the full uncut versions, so you can head over to. Patreon uh, to see the full uncut version of each episode. And uh, by the time you're seeing this on YouTube, I'm sure all the episodes are already going to be on on Patreon. So go check that out. And uh, on to the next episode!